Hi, my name is Dr. Robert Groisman, and today I wanted to talk about sleep and long COVID. Specifically, how is sleep affected by long COVID? As many of you are aware or experienced, um, long COVID can create insomnia. This can happen due to the increased symp uh, sympathetic nervous system tone, which prevents your body from being able to go into deep sleep. So if we look at the different brain frequencies during sleep, uh, we have everything from being awake um, to being an alpha wave, a theta wave, or a delta wave. The only difference between these waves is the frequency of the brain activity. Most people, while they're awake, are going to be either in the alpha or beta frequency range. Beta frequency range a lot of times can also cause a bit of anxiety, as can gamma waves. What we're after here is the delta wave, the, the deep delta wave sleep. And during the course of the night, you will go into different stages of sleep, uh, from even being awake to REM sleep, and of course, light sleep and deep sleep. And what we are interested in is spending more time in deep sleep, especially during long COVID. So what is REM sleep? Um, everybody's kind of fixated on REM sleep. Um, it is rapid eye movement. It is when you dream. Uh, it is also when you have nightmares. Um, your body is paralyzed so that you're not acting out your dream or nightmare. Um, actually, the sympathetic nervous system is activated during rapid eye movement. Your brain is actually processing everything that's happened during the day or everything that you've been thinking about during the day. And um, interestingly enough, REM sleep is not associated with uh, sleep sleepwalking at all. So what happens during deep sleep? So we repair tissues. Our cells regenerate. All of the maintenance processes are also taking place during deep sleep when the parasympathetic nervous system is able to be fully activated. Your heart rate slows down, your breathing slows down, and even your temperature decreases. Um, all these things happen during deep sleep. Why this is so important with long COVID is, is that in a chronic sympathetic um, high state that long COVID creates or causes, the... Um, the body is not able to remain or even get into deep sleep for any length of time. That decreases your ability to heal, uh, heal your tissues, and even get a good night's sleep. Uh, even if you have been unconscious, you may not actually be truly relaxing and sleeping uh, because sleep is, not, is more than just uh, being unconscious. As you know, there's many ways to become unconscious, but that doesn't mean you're going to wake up afterwards uh, refreshed and, and bright-eyed and ready to go. So what we're after, what everybody's after, is the deep sleep. Um, and long COVID prevents this uh, because of the sympathetic overdrive. Um, thank you, and um, I hope you enjoyed the talk on how sleep is affected uh, during long COVID.